With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello friends, the problem is a standing wave is represented by y is equal to a sin 100t cos 0.01x. Okay, where x and y and a are in milli, uh, millimeter and t is in second. The velocity of the wave will be, okay, so we need to tell the velocity of the wave. Now, if we see the general wave equation, that is y is equal to a sin omega t cos kx. Okay. Now, comparing this equation with this equation, we will be getting omega is 100 as it is coefficient of t and k is 0 0.01, the coefficient of x. Okay. So, we will be getting omega is equal to 100 and k is equal to 0 0.01. Now we know that the speed of the wave is v is equal to omega that is angular frequency and k that is angular wave number. Okay. Now we have the values for both and putting them we will be getting 100 upon 0 0.01. Okay. So this will be giving us 10 raised to power 4 meter per second. Okay. So which option should be the correct? Option 1 is the correct option. Okay. Thank you for watching. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.